Susan's awareness, interest, desires, and action. Greetings and grand rising, ladies and gentlemen. It's your social media savior and urban pop culture content creator, Raider Raw. And I'm going to need you to like, comment, subscribe, and follow Raider Raw on all your favorite social media platforms because I have a worldwide presence. And let's not forget, improvement never comes with one conversation. So what are we talking about today, right? Today will be a very brief vlog for me because today we are talking about Vince McMahon. No chance, that's what you got. As you may already know, and I mean the wrestling fans, not, not you guys over there. Vince McMahon has stepped down from his roles and responsibilities as CEO and Chairman of the WWE. Well, it's about damn time. Vince McMahon isn't stepping down due to old age. No, he's actually stepping down because allegations have surfaced that he paid $3 million of his own personal money to an employee of his to keep a hot Sean an affair they were having. But it doesn't stop there. But of course, why would it? <laughs> because Vinny Mac also gave the employee $100,000 And that is when the shit hits the fan. Now some wrestling fans are elated. And you wanna know why? Because over the past 10 to 15 years, the WWE has done nothing more than force feed us senseless and ridiculous storylines. And we as wrestling fans try to hold on and justify the reasons why we continue to watch this product in the eyes of those who say, well, isn't wrestling fake? To answer your question in unison, I have to say that yes, wrestling is fake. However, it's just as real as love and hip hop, real housewives of whatever town you're living in, 90, 60, 30 day fiance, and any other reality shows that we have been subjected to on your Viacom TV network. However, going back to Vince McMahon, this isn't the first time that this has happened. As a matter of fact, in 1992, during the steroid trial, Vince McMahon stepped down from the CEO position, but still maintained creative control. So 30 years later, history is repeating itself. As a wrestling fan, I'm very disappointed. But I'm sure I'm not the only one who wants to air out my grievances. So that's why I'm gonna ask you to like, comment, subscribe, and follow Raider Raw on all your favorite social media platforms. And let's continue the conversation. Until then, peace, love, and apple juice. Word the Big Bird. I'm out.